Let's do this. Hi, I don't know how to begin. All right. Hello everyone, good afternoon. How are you guys doing today? I hope everyone is doing amazing and doing well. All right, now, <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't really know how to begin this video. I think this is the video that a lot of you guys have been waiting for. And to be honest, I have been dreading <laughs> for this day to come that I had to sit down and eventually make this video. Where do I begin? Um, if you guys can see on the title below, um, Tom and I decided to go our separate ways. Yes, we broke up. And um, if you guys have followed him on his own channel, he did release a video about the relationship, about moving on. And I thought I never had to do it in my own channel anymore because he did it. But there's still a lot of you guys that sends me messages in my Facebook, in my Instagram, especially the comments here on YouTube, even in my business email. If uh, Tom and I broke up, if I'm I single now, if we are still together, and all of these questions revolving around our relationship. So there, this is the video, okay? Uh, we are now separated. It's been months and I know that it took me some time to open up and share this to you guys. There's a few reasons behind it, okay? First is I was prioritizing my own healing. I wanted to move on first before I share and open this up to you guys. Second, I wanted to share and open it up to my family first. Um, before I share it to the world, <laughs> to the world, <laughs> to everyone. Yeah, I think that was just the two main reasons why it took me some time to share. But now that I have finally moved on, now that I have finally accepted that the relationship is over, that's why I am here talking to you guys, opening it up to you. And I know some of you will say that, MJ, you don't owe us an explanation about your relationship or about your life it's up to you if you want to share it or not but I chose to share okay I mean I put my life here in YouTube and share it to you guys I put my relationship here and you guys have been a part of it so I know that I owe you guys this video yeah I just want to say sorry that it took me some time a lot of you have been so disappointed that I wasn't answering these questions but I hope you guys will understand. I know you guys will understand for sure. You guys love me. <laughs> but yeah, okay. Now you guys know your reason. Yeah, I hope this video clears it up. I just want to share though that um, it has been a good, fruitful three years uh, being with Tom. We've had good relationship. I will cherish all the memories we've had together. After all, he, you know, helped me with my self-growth and my career as well and of course going through life experiences and travel so yeah i have been just so grateful looking back of our relationship together and <laughs> i think this video is going to be like all over the place guys okay because i don't really know like where like how should i lay it out but i'll just say whatever it is that will pop up in my mind okay <laughs> before i forget this um i just want to share as well that the very main reason maybe why it took me some time to share this video with you is that it took me some time to share it open it up with my family uh especially with my mom so if you guys know that mom and i traveled to singapore and even then it's been months um i have not even told her um about the relationship though scarlet kind of gave her a hint but good thing mom didn't really fell for it so <laughs> uh, scarlet knew the very first thing it happened because she was there but yeah anyway um it's just the last day that mom was in Singapore that I shared it to her. So you guys have kind of the same timeline as when you guys was able to confirm, you know, that the relationship has ended. I think I was just pretty much overthinking that mom would react badly um, about, you know, 
that things didn't end up well. I think she already had an idea that it was happening because we were not talking to each other anymore in video call, which normally we would every day. So there's this one time we were in the room <laughs> and mom just popped the question and I was so like shocked about it. And I was pretty much caught off guard that she asked this question randomly. I'm like, whoa, wait. <laughs> and then I just eventually like said it to her that um, we ended things up um, a few months back. And then she was like, oh yeah, that's why, la 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 la. And then, yeah, I was just really overthinking that mom would say bad things about him or would say bad things about me. That's why we did not end up together. But yeah, it was just actually not. Um, she was very supportive of it. She gave me some words of wisdom about life, about love. And I was very happy that I was able to open up to mom. I have been wanting, like I was waiting for the right timing to open it up to her because yeah, that actually completed the puzzle of my healing process. So that's why I'm finally doing this video because I am now healed. I am now complete with my healing. I am very grateful actually also to my friends because they were the first ones that was there for me since it happened. So to bro, my twin, Vingal, Lynn, and Leah, they were there um, for me when I had to go through the breakup process. You know, after all, that's three years of us being together and it's not easy detaching yourself from the person that you've been so used to having in your life. Hence the drunk video, you guys have seen that. Um, as much as possible, I know that I want to be very transparent to you guys about my life and my relationship and all that. I know that I wasn't ready to fully share what has been happening, but also I want to convey at the same time what I was feeling inside. So I think the OGs um, was able to figure it out because of the vlogs that I released. We had the first drunk video. <laughs> I think that was the most vulnerable thing I ever shared here on my channel. Next is also the first ever solo travel to Baguio. I was so happy I did that trip. I booked that flight because that was one of the things that really helped me with my healing. I can't believe I'm actually doing this right now. It's so weird. And also there are friends that was asking me, questions about the relationship that I just had to say it was still going even though it had already ended and that's because I was just really not ready to all the empathies to all that I'm sorry it did not work out like it will be best for you or you know all the this kind of stuff so this is also one of the reason why I wanted to fully move on first from the relationship before I share it to you guys so now, what I want from you is that I just want to have positive comments, okay? Um, I know I cannot control what you guys type in your computer or what you guys put in a comment section, but I just want positivity, all right? Now, you guys might be asking, what is the reason of the breakup? I think if you guys have been following our joint channel um, or us together, you guys will have an idea already of what was the reason but to put things straight um tom and i has different wants in life and there is no more reason to hold on to something or to hold on to someone that doesn't align with your future so we decided to just you know go our separate ways i think it's best for the both of us i mean for me it's actually been good um, i enjoy my own freedom i enjoy my own independence especially in traveling i never would have thought i would love traveling alone or like sleeping alone or even doing things alone um, i've really really grown as a person um, after the breakup and i'm just really grateful that i'm able to go through this kind of breakup now that i'm mature because yeah, uh, it's been a different healing process for me way back then um, with my previous relationship. So I just want to ask a favor from you guys that um, let's all be positive in the comments. Let's not 
you know, be nasty towards him or towards me. Um, it just didn't work out, okay? Um, I hope that now that I've moved on, I hope that we can all move on, okay? And I just want to say that I don't have any bad blood towards Tom. I still support him. I wish him well in whatever endeavors he is going to take. Um, in the future, I hope that you guys will also still support him if he continues to do traveling on his own channel. And yeah, I just want peace and I really wish him the best because after all, he is a part of my life and I would always cherish the moments we've had together. So now I'm finally single and I'm not rushing into things to form another relationship because now, of course, the walls have back up. It's pretty high up now <laughs> for sure so yeah uh, i just want to enjoy um, traveling now there is going to be a lot of exciting um, adventures that we are going to take guys together and uh, for now i just want to focus on myself so again thank you so much guys for supporting tom and i for the last three years um i really really appreciate you guys you might be asking what's gonna be happening in our joint channel i think if you go to our joint channel you can no longer find it um i have already deactivated the channel we had to close this chapter of our lives together so i hope we can all move on from here on it's gonna be me and my channel and of course the people that we will be meeting along the way um, in this new journey that we are going to take. So again, thank you. Thank you guys all so much um, for supporting our relationship. I hope we could already uh, close that chapter. All right. <laughs> okay. I, f I cannot believe I finally did this video. Anyway, I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Again, I'm always, always going to be very thankful to each and every one of you. I hope that you guys are doing great wherever you are in this world. And I hope that you will support uh, me in my own journey and my traveling, solo traveling this time. And yeah, uh, I'm so excited what's going to be happening next. All right, I will see you guys on my next one. Don't forget to smile and be happy. Bye.